it is time for bed. But first, let us go to the window and look way up into the sky. Are you standing at the window? See how dark it is in the sky. It is dark because the sun has gone to bed. The sun is the great big ball of light we see shining in the daytime. The sun does not really go to bed, but the earth on which we live turns its back to the sun then the sun does not shine on us and the sky is dark and it is night now let us play a little game you will be the earth when I count to three you turn your back to the window ready one two three now Turn. You can't see the sky now. Well, the earth is always turning too, just like you did. Sometimes it turns toward the sun, and we have day. When it is day, it is time to get up. In the daytime, you play or get ready for school. Now, one, two, three. Turn again to the window. Look out the window. Look way up into the sky. I want to tell you something about the earth on which you live. Have you a little ball? The ball is round. Do you know what round means? Can you make your hands round like a ball? Well, the earth on which all little girls and boys live is just like a ball. But the earth is a great big ball. On the earth are all the houses, streets, and trees. Everyone lives on this ball we call earth. Some people live on one side of the earth and some on the other. This big ball, the earth, is turning so fast no one can fall off of it. Do you see any little lights way up in the sky? Those little lights are stars. A star is a big ball that shines. Look at the stars. They do not look like balls, do they? They are far, far away. That is why they seem so little. Now, I want you to look for the moon. The moon looks like a great, big, white plate in the sky. Sometimes it looks like a broken plate, just a tiny piece of it shining in the sky. Do you see anything that looks like a very big shining plate? The moon is not really a plate. It is a ball like the earth and the stars I told you about. It looks very big because it is closer to you than are the stars. Open your hands now. Put your hand against your nose. Is your hand touching your nose? See how big your hand looks when it is close to your nose. Now take your hand away from your nose. Look at your hand. It is not so big now, is it? The stars are bigger than the moon, but the moon is closer to you, closer to your nose. That is why the moon looks so big. Sometimes the sky at night is very dark. Then we cannot see the moon and stars. Did someone turn off the light of the stars and moon? No, their light is still shining, but the clouds hide them. 
Let us play another little game. It will tell you about the clouds. We will make believe you are a star way up in the sky. Your hands are a cloud. Now put your hands over your eyes. Don't peek. Now you can't see. It is dark, isn't it? The clouds in the sky hide the stars and moon just like your hands cover your eyes. That is why we cannot see their light. Take your hands away from your eyes. Look out the window. There is the sky again. Clouds in the sky are big puffs of raindrops. They move around in the sky. That is how they sometimes hide the moon and stars at night. Look at your hands. See the fingers on each hand? Wiggle all your fingers. Now look at your feet with their toes. Wiggle all your little toes. All those little toes and fingers are part of you. All the shining stars I told you about and the big moon and earth are a part of a big you. We call the big you the universe. Can you say universe? All little boys and girls everywhere, their mamas and papas and sisters and brothers are a part of this big you, the universe. Would you like to go way out into this universe where the stars and the moon are? Well, let us try to go. Close your eyes tight. Now, Think of all the shining stars in the sky. Think of the big moon. Keep your eyes closed. Now think of going way, way up into the sky where all the little balls of light, the stars are floating about. Think of all the other little boys and girls who are looking up at the stars too. There are big men and ladies who are also looking up into the sky. They are part of the big you, the universe. Do you feel them near you? Now say softly just what I say. God of my heart, may all the boys and girls everywhere And all the men and ladies be good to each other. Because they are all part of the big you. The universe. Now, open your eyes. Tomorrow night, we will go way out into the sky again. We will meet the stars and the moon again. We will meet all the other people who look up into the sky. Then you can tell them something. Maybe they will tell you something too. Now it is time for bed. Think about what you want to tell the people in the sky tomorrow night.
Are you ready for bed and sleep? All little girls and boys must sleep. When they play all day, they need rest. Do you know what rest means? Let me show you. We will play a little game. Put your hands way up on the top of your head. Now, touch your toes with your hands. Reach way down. All right. Put your hands on your head again. Now, way down, touch your toes. Once more, put your hands on your head. That is all now. Put your hands down. Feel how nice it is to just stand quiet and still. You are resting now. When you close your eyes and go to sleep, you rest too. Then when you wake and open your eyes, you will feel very, very nice. Before you get into bed, you must say your prayers. Get down on your knees. Put your two hands together. Think of all the good things, the pretty flowers, the little birds that sing in the trees, your little friends, the boys and girls you play with. Think of the sun, the big ball of light shining in the sky. Remember the nice things you have had to eat. You must say thank you for all these good things. God made them all. You want to tell him that you love him because he is good to you. When you say your prayers, you talk to God. He can hear you because God is everywhere. He is the big you, the universe. God is in the stars and in the moon. He is in this room. God is in you. Let us talk to God. You say softly just what I say. Now I close my eyes in peace. To God I am now close. He is in me. He is of me. Bless all boys and girls everywhere. Bless their mamas and papas too. Please God, tell me how to be good so everyone will love me as you love me. I thank God for all that I have so mote it be. Now climb into bed and good night. Everyone loves little boys and girls that are kind. Kind boys and girls never hurt other little children or make them cry. You are going to be kind. You will smile when you play. You will not take toys and things away from others. You will be kind, kind, kind. You will always do what Mama and Papa ask you. Mama and Papa love you. They want to be good to you. Remember, do just what Mama and Papa ask you. You must like pretty things. 
The sky is blue and pretty. The little fluffy white clouds are pretty. You have pretty picture books. Pretty things are nice. Look for things that are pretty. Draw pretty pictures. Sing pretty songs. Remember, be kind. Do what we tell you. Love pretty things.